It is one of the most unusual and fascinating buildings in the world. The Atomium in Brussels. And it is this, of all things, that our apprentices are being asked to recreate. The challenge. Some 30 apprentices, 8 different trades, 9 Siemens vocational training centers throughout Europe, and a total of just 4 weeks time to prepare a true-to-life model of the Brussels landmark. We begin at one of our training centers in Germany, where our apprentices in training as technical product designers create the design plans for the Atomia model, print the spheres, and mount the LEDs. Alongside their apprenticeships, the learners are also completing their studies in mechanical engineering. This combination of training, which conveys a great deal of practical expertise, is very much in demand in the job market. Just like the four budding mechatronics technicians who are providing the electronic backbone for the lighting of the model at the training center in Vienna. Over half of all employers in Europe think that young people do not have the necessary skills for employment after completion of their education. As a result, companies cannot fill their vacancies, even though youth unemployment in many parts of Europe is staggeringly high. Our dual vocational training and education model is also successful in Barcelona. Apprentices contribute to the success of the project by manufacturing the connecting rods. With a quality transnational cooperative education model, we provide a solid professional foundation and optimally prepare our apprentices for a working life that is digital and connected. For over 125 years, we have taught professional and transversal skills. This combination of theory and practice currently benefits our 11,500 learners worldwide. Next stop, Budapest. Here, our apprentices construct and mill the pillars for the Atomia model. Work-based vocational education and training is broken down into three areas. In vocational schools, apprentices are taught the theoretical foundations. In our training centers, we develop knowledge and skills relating to the application. And in the practical phases, the apprentices demonstrate their skills in the company under real-life conditions. They did it! The apprentices in Northampton have assembled the last parts of the Atomia model. This is our answer to the question of how to cope with the complex demands of the world of work in the digital age, how to bring young people into work, and how to ensure the competitiveness of European industry.